last summer actually I got really into it. It was my first year that I, I really started getting into fishing. I, I bought an 18 foot Lund fisherman's boat, trolling motor, GPS, depth finder. So that's the one I have on my boat right there. It's got a GPS. It just shows you places on the lake where you are, mostly fish, but also show whatever else is floating underneath. This is probably about 10 different things that you gotta think about before you go out on the lake and, and fish for the different different types of fish. We got a uh, rapella, we got some axe wraps. Um, these ones are a lot bigger than what I'm used to using. There's actually a hook that I have. It's a, a beer cap with a hook going through the end, so I've never actually caught anything off it, but they say you can catch some fish with it. You got your bigger ones, floating ones. This one's gonna be sinking. Couple ones that are going to be top water. The biggest bass I caught, I think, is probably well, four and a half, five pounds, which isn't huge, but for, for our lake, it's a good size. And I mean, there's been six pounders caught in our lake. I just haven't had the luck of catching one. Here's a six six medium rod. Um, probably could be used for pretty much largemouth or smallmouth bass. Actually, you could probably use it for anything, walleyes, anything. But a nice spinner. Uh, lightweight so there's so many different techniques so pretty much just trial and error well that's a bat to knock fish out I've, uh, I've never used one before I uh, I would never use one but I guess for bigger fish you have to look after yourself before you get hurt trolling motors are uh, easy to use it's something that you don't have to use the, the big motor for uh, to make noise to disturb the fish it's quiet the fish don't hear it so that you can I guess sneak up on them a little bit it's probably the best thing that you, you need for uh, if you're gonna go out and fish in one day. Bumpers for the boats. I, uh, I need a lot of these because I'm not the best driver. I hit a lot of docks. Fishing's just a, a place where you can go, go away from everything, um, kind of think things through, just kind of get away from the hockey life for a bit and relax.